basic. Uh, we went down by 11 at one point, I think, in the third quarter, and uh, we had to battle back one basket at a time, and uh, we came out on top. You literally put the team on your back the entire second half of the game. How was that feeling? I mean, it's expected. Um, people come out to see a show, and uh, when we got down, I said uh, to myself, it's got to be now. I got to go now. Unless not, I was going to hear it for the rest of rest of my life, really, uh, how we lost in, in the third uh, run. It seems like there was a, a battle. You know, in, in every game, there's a game within a game. Tonight, that end game was between you and Sydney. Talk about the competition between you and two guys mm -hmm. down the stretch of the game. You know, I'm, I'm always up for challenges. Um, that's that's one of the things you get when you're um, the number one player in the nation. Everyone's always um, out to get you. You know, you have a target on your back. But um, I like to compete, you know, so uh, I thought that was a good battle for tonight. Uh, this entire season, this is the first time I've gotten a chance to speak to you. But the entire season, I've been talking to, you know, young kids your age about uh, having confidence, expectations, and um, execution down the stretch. How do you feel you did on all three down the stretch of the game? Confidence is there, 100%. Um, you have to have that um, in order to be a, a good player. And um, execution, uh, I, my free throws could have been a little bit better, but, you know, that's the mindset that you have to have. You miss one, you got to be able to hit the next one. So um, I feel like those areas were good <laughs> good enough for this win, but always can be better. I mean, uh, with less than 30 seconds left on the clock, I think everybody in the arena expected you to get the ball and do what you do. Walk me through that. Uh, I, call, I, call it, I dribbled the court. Um, I called a timeout because uh, I got caught in the trap. And coach drew up a play, um, and the ball was going to me. I knew it was going to me. I posted up, got the ball, it was doubled, and I still was able to make the shot with like 26 seconds left. So um, that was that was it. As you close this chapter in your life and you begin a new, what can we expect from you, and how do you expect to get better? Um, you know, just be on the lookout. Uh, I'm, I'm ready to, willing to work. Uh, UConn, you know, is UConn. So uh, um, that's why one of the reasons I'm going there um, to better myself and um, better the team. And um, hopefully, I'll be a, a value, a valuable piece to that that legacy. The number one female high school female basketball <laughs> player in the nation, including Russia. <laughs> <laughs> Ever since ninth grade, I uh, haven't had a normal life. You know, everyone's uh, looking at you, seeing what you're doing, and wonder, wonder if they can take a picture with you, talk to you, wonder what's on your mind. So I enjoy it all. You know, I'm, I'm willing to uh, share my knowledge and um, everything else with uh, others.